Stinking hill. Roger. Oh. I don't tell me sides they pushed us back down again. Yeah, Fox Company. Pulling back at the base of the hill. Yeah, second time in three hours. Left Company caught the same garbage before they did. Cage, take a position by those woods. Crouch might try to move in and take the bridge that way. All right. soldier. Marcini. Pete Marcini. What's your outfit? Love Company. First platoon. Love Company. Weren't you up in that hill a couple hours ago? Yeah. Well, where's the rest of the outfit? Still there. four or five guys to back us up. And I talked to this guy. I talked to him on the radio and I said, I said, we, we need help. And he wouldn't come. He wouldn't help. Who wouldn't help? Some guy. I don't know his name. I was trying to call for help on the radio. And I picked this guy up on the air. And I told him we were, we were being cut to ribbon. We need a man. But he, he didn't care. He, he wouldn't come. They probably couldn't even hear you, that's all. And he heard me. He heard me. Well, I'll find him. White Rock. White Rock? That's his call sign. White Rock. I'm White Rock. Starring 
Rick Morrow. And Rick Jason. Guest star, Tom Simcox. on the other end of that radio. That's right. You louse. You rock! Hey, 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 he let him die! He let him die! I played with I, him. I asked him for help. He didn't care. Okay, let him alone. Come on, let him alone. I'm going to see you get this straight. I heard you call for help, but I couldn't do anything about it. Why not? I had my orders. Orders? That's right. To guard this bridge. You mean sentry duty? I mean to stop the Germans from getting across. If they got across, they could have flanked our whole position. If. Could have. Will you tell me, Sergeant? How many Germans came across that bridge? None. None! Well, while you were looking at that bridge, and while you were watching for crowds to come across there that never came, my men got wiped out, every one of them. Look, the crowds killed your squad. We didn't do it. Now, look, I'm sorry about your squad. Yeah, you're sorry. But if it happened again exactly the same way, I'd make that same decision. Hey, Lieutenant. Got three boxes of ammo in here for you. Gage, Kirby. Three boxes. You moving out, Lieutenant? Yeah. Item company and us. Up that hill. Two hours. Oh, it's our turn now. Yeah. Who's he? Nice Marcini. Bluff company. Got his whole squad shot out from under him up in that same hill. This is the route that Love Company took, and they really got skinned. S2 says there's a shallow ravine over here on the left. Maybe that's the way to go up. Seems like all the other approaches are blocked. Well, it certainly seems worth a recon. Why don't you take one man and have a look? All right. Cage! Yeah? Saddle up. Okay. Lieutenant? Yeah? That same map my company officer had doesn't show everything. That ridge drops off. Can't go around it, crowds are dug in with machine guns. You tried it? Yes, sir, we tried it. What about uh, over here, where you come out of the ravines? I don't know. They caught us before we got around there. Cut us out. You got any suggestions? Yes, sir, I'll go along with Sergeant Saunders. I'll show him the way. Certainly it would be easier if you went with somebody who'd been up there before and knew the way. You all right, Marcini? Any wounds? No, sir, I'm fine. All right, go on along with Saunders. Just take a look around, see what you can find. Get back here fast. We had that here in two hours. Perfect, huh?
How many crowds was it came across that bridge you were guarding? Now tell me again, how many were there? That's Sweeney over there. Skinny farmer from Indiana. Worked just had a third kid before he came over here. And that's Hawkins. Hawkins, he, uh... That's why you volunteered, huh? And that's why you took me out of the way. You get this straight, we're on a mission. We have to get that information back to Lieutenant Hanley as soon as possible. One more wrong move out of you and you've had it. From now on, you follow me. Let's go. Higgins. Always dropping his pipe. Always leaving it somewhere. Let's go. Pretty clean all through here. Cover's pretty good. Crowd artillery is getting heavier. All right, let's report it back to the Lieutenant. Station. Thirty. Oh, it's got to be an OP they're setting up. That's what it is, all right. We're heading for a water station. How do you know? You speak German? Not much, but I understand a little of it. Clear view down the whole slope. If we can knock it out and get word back quick enough, it'll be a lot easier for all of us coming up that hill. You get that one, I'll get the one on the ladder. You have to use your bayonet. We don't want to tip them off inside.
I'm gonna get you out of here. Set up. Listen to me. If the Germans set up an observation post here, they'll wipe them out with artillery. This OP doesn't answer. Forget it. Smash it and get down to Lieutenant Haley right away. Will you shut up? Auf. Auf, stay off. Number one, that was not in order. End it. Auf. Auf, stay off. Auf, stay off. Trust him. I told you I'm running this thing now. Eine schnelle Bewegung. Tu was ich sage. Americans in here. End up. Verstanden. Ende und aus. What was that? What? What do you say about the Americans? They ask if there's any American activity in the area. Los.
Who's gonna answer that now? We haven't got any more time to lose. Get going. Sie sich bitte. Ende. Herr Feldwebel, Sie antworten immer noch nicht. Vielleicht sollten wir jemanden raufschicken, die brauchen Ersatzteile. Gute Idee. Hans, Karl. Nummer eins, melden Sie sich. Ende. Nummer eins, ist alles in Ordnung. Ende. Antworten Sie, Nummer eins. Ende. Nummer eins, ist alles in Ordnung. Wo seid ihr? Ende. Even if you get that off me, I don't know if I'm going to be able to walk out of here. You make it. I'll see that you make it. Listen to me. You picked up a pipe back there, and it belonged to a buddy of yours. You called him Hagen. There could be 40 or 50 more Hagens coming up that hill when that attack starts this afternoon. Unless you give him a chance. Massini. Give him a chance.
doesn't seem like anything's broken. I feel pretty numb. Come on, let's get out of here. everything you could, but there's no time left. You have to get back to Lieutenant Hanley and give him the message. Yep. Come on, hang on. We're gonna have to crawl. real quiet and don't move I'm gonna have to get down as as fast as I can I can't make it with you you mean you're leaving me here I'll come right back for you what do you mean you'll be back sergeant you're gonna leave me here you're trying to say you're running out. I should have known. I, I should have known. It's a bridge all over again, ain't it, Sergeant? Let him die. Let him die. If the mission comes first. Well, come on, get out of here!
Straight up this way, Lieutenant, all the way to the ravine. It's pretty good cover. What about the pump house, the OP? How far up is it? So it's just about here. Half a mile, maybe more. How bad, Martini? It's pretty bad. This is King 2. Give it King 6. King 6, Lieutenant Hanley. I've got that recon report, sir. You better let me have a look at that leg, Sarge. Later, Doc. Get some plasma and a stretcher. We have to take care of my senior right away. Okay, you're on us. All right, sir. Yes, sir. Move out in ten minutes at your signal. Yes, sir. Roger, out. All right. We move out in ten minutes at company signal. Saddle up. Lieutenant, taking Cajun, Doc. We're going to bring my senior down. Make it. Yes, sir. All right. Let's go. Company moves out at once. Hey, cover! Roger, out. Now, Lieutenant. Move out!
Cage. You stay here. Cage, give me cover. No, it's not good. You'll never make it. Give me cover. Marcini. Marcini. It's me. It's Saunders. I'll get you out, Saunders. I'll get you out of here. Doc! Marcini, listen to me. We made it. We made it. It's gonna be all right. He came back. Forget it, Doc. Forget it. 